My name is Nicholas, and I work as an electrical engineer in the um, city. Right now, I live in the Bronx. My name is Charlene Siprasad. I'm from Woodhaven, Queens, and I work at an investment bank in New York City. I had a radio station, and I used to host a lot of events. And my fiance at that time was just a friend. She would come out to all these events, and we started, we started decided talking about three years after getting to know each other, just seeing each other at events. And it just happened. He came across extremely sincere and genuine. So I knew at that point he was the one probably like in our early stages of dating. She just motivated me and it made me see more of myself. And you know, at that point in time, I realized, you know, it's great to have someone who's there for you. So we're getting married a uh, week of Thanksgiving um, at the surf club in New Rochelle. I call my fiance Peaches. So we try to just mesh that together and just mesh that as she loves elephants. So we mesh that into our theme as well. I'm here today with my fiance and her best friend, Nicola. Uh, I feel they got the best taste, so we're here with them to see what they like. I came with my fiance and my maid of honor, Nicola, my best friend. My name is Nicola Asun, and I am a fourth grade teacher. I work at a school in Queens. Um, I think Mazarana is the place for me, and I've seen their work um, on social media, and I think this is where it's gonna happen. Hey, how you doing? Nick. Shashank. Hi, Charlene. Nice, nice to, meet to meet you. you. Hi, Nicola. Nice, nice to meet you as well. Uh, how can I help you guys? I am looking for my uh, Sangeet outfit. Okay. Um, I'm looking for something colorful. Uh, do you have your outfit already? No, I don't, but he has limited time, so we're going to try to get his first. And do you have like a budget in mind or so? I'm around 1500 so I Myself. Okay, so that, that's a pretty good budget for, for a Sangeet outfit. Um, let me curate a couple of outfits for you, um, just because you want to see a lot of things on the spectrum. So I want to pick like a bunch of different colors with like heavy, simple. Okay. And then you tell me how you're feeling and then we'll move accordingly. That sounds yeah. good. Yeah? That works. Cool. All right, so I'll see you guys in a few. You guys grab a seat and I'll bring a couple of outfits for you. Great. Okay. Thank right. you. It's our first event. We just want to... Uh to be shown that we are the bride and groom, and I am the groom. He tends to go with my taste anyway, most most occasions. So whatever I like, he'll go with today, and he'll definitely select my preference. I think I would have to, you know, um, happy wife, happy life, so yeah. So the first outfit that I've picked for you is like a navy blue one with a lot of gold work on it. Okay. Um, I'll pull it out for you, let me know how you feel about it. Sure. Cool. Good. So this is a navy blue raw silk shirvani. Okay. It's fully decked out front and back um, and has a little bit of embellishment on the collar. All right. Um, what do you think about this? I'll give it a try. See how it looks like on top of me. Yeah. yeah. So I'll have Shanta take you and then she'll help you put it on. All right. Sounds good. Thank cool. you. All right. So what does Nicholas do? Oh, he's an engineer and oh. he works in the city. Oh, that explains why he can't come out all the time. Yeah, he has limited time. So that's why he has to get his outfit before I do. <laughs> <laughs> that must really sting for you, right? Yeah, I was hoping I can get mine and then have something match the little outfit I pick, but um, it'll all work out. Okay. Yeah. What do you think? I don't know if I like the color. It looks a little, it looks a little too dark, but the embellishment, I do like it. Okay. What do you think? I agree. The color is too dark. It doesn't really mesh with your skin tone. Yeah. Hey, hey, hey. The first outfit, I'm not liking at all. The embroidery was nice, but um, it, it's more so the color. I think we have to look into something different because uh, the color is just not working. What about you? I don't know. I think it's a little bit too dark for a Zangi type of event. I showed you that because you said it was a night event, right? So I wanted to, like, darker colors come out better at night, like right. the gold will come out better. But I like for Mandy, it's okay. You can do a lighter color. Yeah. So we want to do lighter tones? Yeah, yeah definitely lighter. Shana, can you bring out the second one? So I think this is a little more Mandy-esque, like Mandy colors would be like yellows, greens, that sort of thing. So this is also fully decked out. Um, it's not as heavy in the back, but you'll get to see the brocade pattern. Because that one has raw silk front and back, so that's why it's covered all the way. Uh, this one only has work in the front because this way you can actually see uh, the fabric itself in the back. Nice. Yeah? What do you guys think? Yeah, give it a try. Yeah, you can try it out. Okay, so she'll help you put this one on. Great, thank you. 
How'd you feel about that one, Charlene? That was good. Yeah? Yeah. What do you guys think? I love it. I like the color. The color is really vibrant. Um, and you look really handsome in it. Thank you. Um, I definitely like the buttons. And you just look really, really nice. And it fits the sangi perfectly. What do you think? It's definitely the color like you're both envisioning. So I really like this on you. I really, really like it. Yeah, that's... Yeah, I, I like it a lot, man. Like, I think it's, it's a good balance. It's not too heavy. But you don't think like a regular guest coming to an event would be wearing something like this? Like, I want to stand out. I'm the groom. <laughs> I, I doubt any of your guests will be walking in with something like that. But I mean, I can understand if you want something heavier. I love it. I think it looks, you look handsome. It's just the right amount of work. I agree. Um, it looks so nice on you. It's not too simple. It's know. not too ornate. Yeah, I'm, I'm not, it's beautiful. I mean, yeah, I'm not. <sighs> to me, this is beautiful. This is a winner. The right amount of embroidery, the gold tone just matches skin tone so beautifully. And I think he looks so handsome in it. I really like the different textures from the front and the back. So, so far, that one is my favorite. It's, it's up there on the list, but I, I really think I need to see something else. I'm gonna say no. Why don't you like it? <laughs> color, the workup, I just feel needs a little bit more going on. Probably a little bit of a lighter color. Um, would you do like a peachish? I, yeah, I 100% would do peachish yeah. color. Would you be okay with the peach, Charlene? I'm open. I'm open to seeing this it. This one is still really, really nice. yeah. funny. Yeah, story though. I like this. I'll call it peaches. Oh. <laughs> yeah, you did, you'll I'll be great. Peach one for you. <laughs> This is much heavier piece. I usually wouldn't recommend it for a sangeet outfit, but I think like your design palette is on the heavier side and it has a nice element to it. Like there's an elephant here um, and there's their elephants drawn on them, the sleeves, and this was specifically done by us. Um, just, to, just to have a piece that stands out a little more different than everything else. You don't think that it's too much? No. It's too much embellishment? Comparing this to that. I still really love this one that you're wearing. I know you guys really love this. Why don't we just have him try it on and then we'll take it from there? Okay. okay. Yeah. yeah. All right. Try. Okay. So she'll help you put that on. Great. Thank you. This is beautiful. What do you think? I, I don't love it. I still think it has way too much embroidery for just a Sangeet night. Too, too much shimmer going on. I think it's perfect. Perfect amount of beadwork. As you mentioned in the very beginning, there's a break between the peach, the peach colors here. It has, it has it going. It's a little too loud for just what the event is. I mean, it's definitely your color, but it is a little too overwhelming. No, I disagree on this completely. Outfit. I, I really think we need to just add something more to it, customizing it, making it look a little bit, you know, more to the event. I really think like you could add like a ganache or something, you know, cause the event. Remember, it's just a Sangeet night. Why would we do that? It's the first event of our wedding. Yeah, but we also have to buy other outfits and there's other venues and there's a lot more that goes into this. That would just be too much at this point. I really think this is perfect, but um, just by looking at it, I I was happy when you walked out and you had a smile on my on your face. Like that that was that was good enough for me. Uh, but that's something that you guys need to discuss. Um, I know you were talking about putting a Ganesh in the back. I think that would kind of be cool because it already has elephants on it. Yeah. Um, so, so we already talked so it's sort about of, this. No, I mean it's just a thought. Like I really think it's it's worth it. Yeah, and, but you, you know, didn't even ask for my input, and you went ahead and said that you wanted it customized. So I don't think that that's fair. I don't know. I really, really, really want to do it. I, I really don't think it makes sense arguing about. It. I think you should really think about hear what he has to say. I think it'll you know it'll go very well with the outfit. Ganesh is the first puja you do for the wedding. So if we could add a Ganesh to the back of it, I think that'd be pretty cool. He's definitely not listening to me or Charlene, and he definitely definitely needs to take our advice. He should have confronted me about the customization. Um, it's news to me, and it's not something we discussed about. So I was hoping he would have asked me for my input. I think Charlene, she's more upset about the fact that he's not going with the outfit that she likes, and she thinks this is too heavy. Um, and that's kind of the reason why she's going against the customization part of it. No, uh, I'm really going to get this one and customize this one. I, I have to. Yeah, I mean, you'll be able to customize your outfit and, you know, do something more to it. We came in here with a set budget. We said that we wouldn't do something too, too much. It's kind of overtaking, like, what the event is meant to be. Nicole, what, what do you think? think? So? I completely agree. It's too much. Yeah, but I'm just going to do this. Like, honestly, what's your opinion? Like, I, I really want the customization. It's going to be made to me. 
Yeah, if you if you customize it, we can we'll have to build it from scratch for you. It will take about two to three months. Um, the color will be exactly the same. All the work will be replicated to the T. But don't you think we should have discussed this first? This is definitely not what we signed up for. It's not a big deal. And the cost difference, you know, it's... Uh, this piece is about 1600 and then the customization would make it about 300 more. Well, it's a work. Um, it's it again. just way too much. Remember, you have other events going on. But you got to think about it this way. We're getting married. And what if the customization doesn't come out in time and it doesn't it, it doesn't come out the way you want it to be? What I'm, are we going to do I'm then? Sure, Charlene, I, would. I wouldn't worry about that so much just because like on, on an outfit like this, mm -hmm. color will be exactly the same. The design will be exactly the same will be made to his measurements from scratch. Uh, the only difference will be like a Ganesh motif in the back and then that also you can pick the design that you like and then we can we can hand embroider that design on the back. So it'll definitely be a cool, cool part and you have more than enough time. So even timing wise, I wouldn't be so concerned. It's just you need to figure out whether you like the piece or not. No, this is absolutely beautiful. I mean, I just wish you would have told me about this. Again, as I'm saying, we're getting married. You know, you're getting a, a gown, you're getting an outfit, it's all customized to you. Why not get something made to measure, fits me perfectly, and, you know, probably uh, engrave my name inside of it or stitch it in so it's mine. You love the color. Yes. I think the color is, yeah, the the color color is, is nice. Good. It the matches skin tone. You love yeah. elephants. I definitely think it fits you very well and you look handsome in it. Thank you, but I really, really want the customization and I think we're going to go with it. I, I want to get the customization. Okay, sounds good. Are, are you okay with it? All right, then I'm then I'm open. Yeah, doing this. Yeah. All right. Thank cool. you. I'm yeah. looking forward to it. I'm so happy that you're happy, man. No, no, you guys did an amazing job, and I really love this outfit, customization. I'm looking forward to it. That's Thank cool. you. Yeah. It is the one. It, you know, I absolutely love it, and I cannot wait to wear it. What if he doesn't like the Sherwani after it's customized? That's one of my biggest concerns. You know, it has the glam, it has the wow factor for our Sangeet, and a great peach color. It fits him beautifully, looks handsome. I don't like the idea, but I am seeing what his vision is like with the Ganesh. So I am understanding why he would want it, but then again, it's still going to be too much um, customization and embroidery on that peach color. I wouldn't expect someone to wear it um, for their Sangeet, but when Nicholas walked out and he had that big smile on his face, like I knew that was his outfit, so I wasn't gonna fight him on it. My name is Navita Paul. I'm from South Ozone Park, New York. I am a special education teacher. My fiance's name is Ricky Shankar. I uh, met him in elementary school, actually fourth grade to be exact. Um, and then we were friends. On my 18th birthday, we had our first date and he walked me home. And on that first day, oh God, I'm getting emotional. <laughs> um, he dropped me home and he um, came upstairs and he met my mom for the first time. He wasn't intimidated and I knew then that he was the one. I am getting married on July 6th, 2018. The theme right now um, is very romantic. We have a lot of neutral tone hues of gold, white, soft pink. It matches the beachfront atmosphere that we're gonna have. Today, I came to Nizrana with my mom and my sister. My name is Nikita, and um, Navita is my little sister, so I'm very excited to be here today. My daughter's Nidhi was one of the best things that ever happened in my life. Um, my daughter's Nidhi, what can I say? She is one of a kind. I'm glad that I'm here to share this experience. And I couldn't get through life without them, so they're definitely, they better be helpful. <laughs> Welcome to Nizrana. My name is Shia, who is my bride. Hi. <laughs> yeah. Navita, nice Navita. to meet you. Yeah. Hi, I'm Nikita. Nikita. Nice to meet you. <laughs> mom. Oh, mom. <laughs> what is your name? Nathan. Oh, it's all ends. Yeah, I see know. that. Yeah. Okay, do you have a wedding date? Uh, it's the summer, actually, so it's coming oh, up. Oh, coming up, mm -hmm. quick. Okay. So it's actually a destination wedding. We're getting married in South Florida. Perfect. We're Hindu, so traditionally uh, brides wear yellow and then change into a second outfit, which is so usually yellow red. would be your first look, right. and then you change. Right. Got it. Is there a budget for each outfit? For both, I'd like to stay within five thousand. That's more than reasonable. Okay. All right. 
So I will get you guys seated, and I'm going to head in the back okay, and start great. picking outfits. Yay, Yay, thank, thank you. you. Thank cool. you, Shia. Right. <laughs> I actually found out about Nizrana through social media, and every post that I saw, you know, people, everyone looked like royalty. So, I mean, everyone wants that on their big day to look and feel like royalty. I am very hopeful that I'm going to get my dress at Nizrana. Navita, the first outfit that I'm going to bring out is a traditional Hindu red outfit. Um, as per your mom's request, let's look at that first, okay. and then we'll go from there. And she's going to bring it out. Wow, very pretty. So hot. I know. <clears throat> I can't say that it's my complete vision. But yeah, I don't think that's your vision. It's not what I had in mind. Yeah, Do you want her to try it? Definitely, yes. Okay. Yes. <laughs> okay well, you should so try we'll it keep out. it here. We'll okay. try it. Okay. Another color that's very popular in your culture is yellow. Correct. So do you want to see like a soft yellow langa? I do. Yeah? Okay, so let's look at that. And for a destination wedding, it actually has a super cool off-shoulder blouse. Okay. And a mint dupatta to match the trim. Okay. No, I'm willing to compromise and do yellow. You think she should try it? Yeah. Absolutely. Okay, yeah. so let's try that one. Okay, great. <laughs> I love it. Well, this we is traditional, yeah. So. Right. <laughs> so yeah. But, there, but there are hints color. of mo there's hints of like modern yeah. with the top, the all gold top. It's not all yellow. The it's off shoulder, the off shoulder, right. is perfect before exactly. That. And with like a big necklace, it's yeah, it'll be stunning. It's stunning. I love it. Yeah, me too. Mom, sold. <laughs> so I'll take this as traditional, and she can yellow for mom, and it can be her first outfit. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, we're not done with the appointment yet, but <laughs> are you ready to be an Azrana bride in that one? I am. Okay. Perfect. Yay! So ready. Right. Well, we got <laughs> like so ready. <laughs> Don't get too excited. One down. One, one down. More to one go. more to go. Yeah. Yes. Okay. All right. right. <laughs> the yellow dress, when I when I put it on, it made me feel very happy and excited. I I think it's the perfect first look for my wedding. I think the yellow dress is absolutely stunning. Wow. Very pretty. It's a lot of everything. That's not her. In terms of color? In terms of color, it looks like a red Crayola crayon threw up all over her. It's gold. just really red. And it's a lot. Yellow, like the gold is a lot. Okay. Mom, what do you think? It's perfect for a traditional wedding. So I, I love it. I absolutely love it. Just doesn't feel like me. Well, now that she's already picked a traditional yellow outfit, are you open to her looking at different colors other than red? Because clearly she doesn't like the color. I have to say I love the outfit. I have yeah. to say I don't. <laughs> no, you, you don't have a say, really. I do. <laughs> I actually do, Mom. <laughs> you yeah. wore red. Mom, this looks like your outfit. <laughs> you got married. <laughs> Every out. bride has worn this outfit. <laughs> no wonder you love it so much. <laughs> For different people. So we've picked some pastel colored outfits that are very magical, fairy tale. Okay. Um, you're having a destination wedding. So take a look and tell me what you think. Okay. Yes. It's it has pearls, it has rose gold, it has hints of red. It's not red like that. It has hints of red, Mom. But I have to see you. I know. See it on you. Yeah. This is what I had in mind. Like okay. the beading and like with the well, pearls. Well, the color of the beading. And that blush pink. It's exactly what I had in mind. Okay. And then That's there's exactly another what I had gold in mind. one. Almost if you read her mind. I don't know how I feel about the gold, like the The fabric. base color? Yeah, I feel like it's. I'm gonna blend in with like the background. It's not gonna really pop. Like, I don't know, what do you think, sis? It doesn't look to me like it me. stands out because, yeah. of, because of her decor being almost very similar colors. So do you wanna try the blush one? Yes. Okay, let's try that one. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> you look absolutely beautiful. I love it. Sis, I love it too. Oh, what does <laughs> mom think? It's gorgeous. I love the fact that the red is in there. It's not traditional, but is it bridal enough? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Well, before, she said she was speechless, and that's really, really, really hard for my mom. Okay. <laughs> <It's fine. laughs> one, one thing though, can can we see how how yes, it works? Yes, absolutely. Yeah. With the dupatta on her head. Ugh. Well, I'm glad we got the red one out of the system. <laughs> I have to yeah, practice right. dancing in it. Sing a song, sis. Wow. <laughs> Thank you. No problem. What do you guys think? I love it. <laughs> I love it. I so love we it have too. the yes. little bit traditional, huh? and this is going to look perfect. The more for, modern. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, are you ready to be an Azrana bride the second time? The second <laughs> time today. Yes, I'm so ready. <laughs> okay. Yay! Congratulations. <laughs> the blush uh, bridal dress is my favorite. It's exactly what I pictured myself wearing on my wedding day. I'm very happy they agreed on a wedding dress. Yes. I'm very excited that I will be purchasing the yellow and the blush bridal outfits for my big day. The blush honestly looked um, a lot nicer than the yellow, but I loved the two of them. Awesome threesome! <laughs>